What's up? It's your boy Chom Tom back with another review, but this will be a different type of review. This will be review from my car. Starting today, I'm gonna be doing takeout reviews from my car. I'm not sure where you're watching this video, but a lot of restaurants in my area, Greensboro, High Point, Winston, and some restaurants in Charlotte are starting to recognize my face. And as a result, I am getting superior service and my food is fairly decent. However, other customers are getting treated like trash and their food is trash too. So I came up with the idea to start doing something called Chime Times Takeout Review, where I do takeout reviews from my car. And with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, the first restaurant on Chime Times Takeout Review is... Yep, this place called Crumble Cookies. We are most definitely about to see what the hype is about today. I've been hearing so much about this place, Crumble Cookies, and uh, I decided to just take time out of my day to day to go try them out. And I got four cookies. I got a chocolate chip cookie, I got cake batter, I got chocolate cake, and I got peach cobbler. So I got a variety of different things, and I really hope uh, this was worth the wait because it was a line, and I really hope this is worth my time. So first, we're gonna be trying the chocolate chip cookie. Go ahead and put it to the screen so y'all can see that right there. So with chocolate chip cookies, I'm gonna be real with you. The best chocolate chip cookie right now, out right now as we speak, is chocolate chip cookies from Tropical Smoothie. They have the best cookies. So I'm not really expecting this to taste that good because with Tropical Smoothie, I've never had cookies that taste that good. So I'm not really expect, oh shit. Oh, I'm sorry. Mm. Nah, nah. Oh my God. Okay. Whoa. Wow. Mm. All right, so with this thing right here, this is this is equivalent to crack right here. This is a very dangerous cookie, and whoever made this should be put in jail for life. Somebody could really get killed over these, man. These right here are really good. They're nice and hot, they're soft, they have a fair amount of chocolate chips on them, mushy in the inside, not overcooked on the edges. They're not overcooked at the bottom. This is crazy, yo. Wow. So on a scale from one to 10, I'm gonna go ahead and get this a, a 10. I'm trying to figure out what the... It's a damn good chocolate chip cookie. All right, Crumble, that's one down. You got three more to go. That was that was a good cookie. Let's try out the peach cobbler. I'm not really a big peach cobbler fan. Not sure why, but uh, <laughs> I think it's mainly because people try to overdo it when they're making peach cobbler. They like peachy it on down, man. And I ain't, I ain't, and I ain't really with all that. I ain't really with all that. I'm gonna try this peach cobbler cookie. They have it in like this little, this little tray type of deal. I wish they would just put it in the box, but maybe this is how it comes, whatever. That's how I look right there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Yo, this. Trying to find the right words for this, cause this is this is this is just as good as a chocolate chip cookie. What are they doing over there at Crumble, man? Like this is. What the hell? All right. Whoa, I gotta put this back in there. These cook. All right. <laughs> Whoa there. So initially, I was preparing for this to be either too sweet or have a lot of peaches, kind of like crowds the taste. It's the perfect balance of peaches, cream, and cookies. Peaches and cream! The cookie is soft, the edges are soft. You think it's nice and warm, it's mushy on the inside. It's not that sweet at all for the ones that don't like sweet cookies. Comes in this little tray right here, just so you guys can see. It's almost like a little pot pie tray, yo. Like a miniature pot pie, man. Yeah, I mean, I gotta say, they are serving up, they are whipping up crack. Uh, in their crumble cookies because this right here, this right here is another cookie that will get somebody smacked. The chocolate chip cookie and this right here makes me want to just call my mama and my grandma and tell them I'm on the way to smack the hell out of you right now. These two cookies right here were just too damn good. So with the peach cobbler cake, I got to give it a nine. Oh! Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, next we have the chocolate cake cookie and this right here is, it's a lot of damn chocolate. I want you guys to see how it look right there. Oh yeah, nice little chocolate swirl on there. It's nice and warm too. Pretty big fan of chocolate cake, man. I like chocolate. I ain't got nothing against chocolate. I just don't like my cake too chocolatey if you know what I mean. Or well, maybe you don't, I don't care. Okay. 
you want. I see how y'all doing over there. So the chocolate cake, I'm gonna tell you right now, if you love chocolate brownies, you're gonna love this cake. Once again, this cake is nice and warm. It is mushy on the inside. It is crowded with taste. It's the pure definition of a chocolate cake. Now, I personally, I am not a fan of a lot of icing. This right here had a load, and I mean a load of icing on it. But minus the icing, this is good. For those that order this chocolate cake, thank me later. Chocolate cake, I gotta give it an A. Last but most certainly not least, ladies and gentlemen, is our cake batter cookie. So you guys can see right there. Yeah, that's a whole lot of icing right there. Yeah, whoever made this didn't give a damn about your weight, calorie count, nor your life. I mean, they just didn't give a damn. But you know, right now, I don't give a damn either. All right. Okay. I hear you. All right. Cake batter. This is probably one of my favorite cookies because I am a huge fan of fun Fetty. This got fun Fetty all up in there. It's almost the mix between a sugar cookie and a fun Fetty cake. Nice and soft, mushy on the inside. The edges aren't overcooked. The bottom isn't overcooked. The only thing I hate and I despise about this right here, it's just too much ice on this cake, man. Y'all gotta chill out, man. Cause right now I'm about to be constipated. Sorry, that might be a little too much information, but that's the God honest truth. And if you look at the top right there, like there are some cookie crumbs up there. I'm not sure if this is decoration or was this pieces from my cookie that kind of fell off. And you guys salt bay my joint on top of the icing. Whatever y'all did, man. I mean, it was it, it was it was definitely pretty dope. So too much icing on the cake batter. I gotta give it an eight. All right, man. So there is a new sheriff in town for sure, and it's called Crumble Cookies. I don't think I ever go to Tropical Smoothie again. I mean, this right here. <laughs> To even mention Tropical Smoothie's name in the same sense as Crumble Cookies is just disrespectful. But someone please smack the piss out of me next time I say Tropical Smoothie, please. Comparing these Crumble Cookies to Tropical Smoothie is almost like comparing Greensboro women to like High Point women, you feel me? <laughs> nah, I'll just play, I'll just, but yeah, these cookies are definitely busting. So now that that's done, I can tell you my experience here at Crumble Cookie. So when I walked up, there was a line out the freaking door and I was like, oh, hell no, nah, I'm not standing in this line, man. Nine degrees outside, it's hot. I just got my hair cut, see how fresh that mug is? Uh-huh, I ain't about to sweat that joint out. Yeah, I know I sound like a female, you know what I'm saying, not trying to sweat her weave out, but it is what it is. But the line did move fairly fast. And they did have a divider outside for the customer standing in line, and it did say cookie lovers here. I, 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 you know what I'm saying, I like that. that, that was very creative. So I walked inside, and the first thing I noticed is that this place has a butt load of employees. It's employees everywhere. Employees to the left, employees to the right. It's employees sliding down the freaking ceiling like Spider-Man. Or that be a stripper. I, I don't know. But it seems like everybody was definitely in tune with what they were doing. Nobody was kind of like distracted. Nobody was smiling. Nobody was like having fun. They were just all about their business, man. When I get up to the front, the first thing I notice is they got the cookies up front. Now, it's a plethora of cookies up there. It's about eight cookies. So for me as a customer, I'm expecting the cashier to kind of give me an overview of what they're selling. And she just won't try to do that. It seemed like she was just trying to get me in and out of there. Which I mean, I feel you. I mean, there was a lot of people in there, but dang, I mean, I am the customer. I shouldn't be asking you questions. You should be telling me what the specials are for the day, what type of cookies you guys offer. This is my first time being here. You should be welcoming me in as a first time customer but you didn't do that. Another key point about this place is everything is digital. So when you go to pay, you swipe your car. After that, you type in how you want your cookies made, whether you want them hot, whether you want them cold, I guess. And I put out one of them hot because I love them hot. So yeah, I mean, that was that. After you finish ordering, after you finish paying your food, I do like the service after you pay. They walk up to you, they show you, hey, are these your cookies? You say yes then you get the hell on up out of there. So I do like that part about uh, crumble cookies. I mean, that that was definitely pretty dope. This place seems like the place to be if you wanna go get some cookies, y'all. You're in the Greensboro, North Carolina area, uh, off Wendover, right behind Chipotle. If you guys love cookies, man, I'm trying to tell you right now, these cookies are gonna make you wanna smack your mama. Hey mama, what the hell you want with? Yo daddy. Smack your goddamn daddy. Yeah. Yo grandma. <laughs> You might even smack your kids, man, because these cookies are off the chain, man. But I tell you what, I tell you what. Guys, go to Crumble Cookies, and when you see this video, 
comment below and tell me what type of cookies you guys have and tell me if it really is worth the hype, all right? But until next time, thank y'all for tuning in to Chomp Top's Takeout Review. If you guys have any questions, concerns, or if you have any takeout joints you would like to see me do in my car, y'all know what to do. Hit me up on Facebook at Chomp Tom or hit me up on Instagram, Mr. Chomp Tom. I gotta get my Instagram back popping too, by the way. Y'all take care. I love y'all. Stay blessed. Peace.